touchdown from Chicago with illegal cargo to meet some guy named Keith from Manhattan Beach. But Keith was out of town and couldn't be reached for two weeks. That's when he called my homeboy Craig. At first, Craig hesitated, then said, okay, but some things needed to be renegotiated. To meet his terms, he had a few concerns. Ricardo was with it because he didn't have no time to burn. So he set up a meeting while he was eating sauce of tortillas and carne asada. Who's side at the Ramada? Ricardo wore silk suits, pushed the cream pants. Craig was a L.A. underground drug cartel kingpin. So they was both evenly matched. I mean, Craig sold everything from hash to crack. Heroin, shrooms, LSD, and crystal meth. This wheel the black Lex, complete with the CD changer. No stranger to the danger of the drug game. And meanwhile, Enrique was hanging out with some thug named Bruce. He used to work part-time bouncing at Tilly's, but made his living hitting niggas with throwaway nine millies. Really didn't make no sense how it went down, and at times I get vexed. Even when I think about it now, Ricardo and Craig both met their fate. That's 24, hold up, I gotta pause for the break. Fuck. 